28 years in, no regrets. I don't think you're going to have a problem. It's perfect. I've never had a job until this one uh, that I look forward to going to work. I mean, it is not work for me. We all work as a team, obviously, so it's all just, you know, one common goal. The team we work with is an amazing team. We got a good group of guys. Everybody's knowledgeable. They help everybody out when somebody needs help. Any information we can pass along from what we see coming in, the trends, we deliver to the rest of the team so that the other techs know uh, some of the stuff that they may not personally be working on, but the trends that we're having in the shop. It is very technical, and everything you touch nowadays, for the most part, you have to do with the computer. The technology's gone so far now that sometimes it's not very easy to troubleshoot. The best thing about joining Cummins is watching the technology develop. Now we're doing a lot more with the environment, um, cleaning up the emissions. Watching the uh, technology develop from a diesel engine that had black smoke just barreling out of the stacks, to now uh, it's been cleaned up so much that even on a, a snap test and acceleration, very, very minimal smoke would even exit the engine. So that's pretty impressive. Looking at the way Cummins deals with, with that and their technology is uh, the best I've seen. I keep up with all the new technology through training courses, um, online training, and then uh, quick serve online. I stay up to date on the technology. They send us to the tr coming to training classes. And that's equal to how many lambdas? All right. I like the classroom training uh, the best because it does both. You get your, your slides and your PowerPoints and stuff, but you also get your hands-on training. It's a combo, and so you learn it in the classroom, then you come out and do hands-on training. My favorite training is obviously the hands-on portion. Uh, me personally, I'm a hands-on type of person, and the classroom training is good, but hands-on is always the best way for me personally. There's the apprentice program that started out, and uh, it reminds me daily that we all started there. If you're interested in growing into a diesel technician field type of thing, you would want to start with small steps, like even working on your dirt bike or your car at home or making your pickup, you know, souping it up, playing with it. Well, I went to UTI and in their automotive and diesel program, uh, completed that course and uh, started here right out of school. I like to work with my hands, you know, and, and that's what I wanted to do as a career path, so. We started out working on chassis work and doing all the dirty, grimy stuff and you worked your way up so you could have enough experience to apply at Cummins because that was the end goal um, is making it with the, you know, on with an engine company and specializing just in a Cummins engine. And I quickly found out that this was my uh, end goal for uh, coming to Cummins. Cummins has been a great place to work for um, with all the technology that they offer you, the training. Um, the co-workers have been great. I've always had a really great work environment uh, with the co-workers. Uh, with safety, technology, everything growing and watching the progression, especially over 26 years of doing it. I come in, uh, start working, and all of a sudden, you know, my supervisor tapping me on the shoulder, hey, it's, it's four o'clock, it's time to go home, like all of a sudden. So it's, it's incredible, so that's what I love. Job.